Hi everybody, this is Kefren, your favorite French Canadian. Today I'm going to show you how to improve your FPS in the new Destiny 2 uh, game. Uh, right now you have two ways that you can uh, change your parameter. You can use the config file or you can use the parameter inside of the, of the game. But the problem right now is like uh, in the config file you can't change, uh, you don't have an other option that you can't really find in the game, so it's pretty much the same thing. So if you want to fi find this file, you need to go to users, the name of your computer, app data, roaming, bungee, destiny PC, prefs, and you open the CVARS file with notepad++ or a notepad. And over there you can change uh, all the parameter that you have right now in the game. Uh, four mean IS, one mean low S. So yeah, that's about it for all the parameter that you see here. So let's go inside of the game. So this is all the parameter that you can change in the game. First of all, make sure that your VSync is at, at off. And uh, yeah, that's about it for this one. Field of view, really nice. They add this. I was wondering if they will add the, the field of view because it's I was it's a port from the console game, but you have a pretty decent field of view. Uh, if your field of if you put your field of view uh, higher than whatever, uh, each time you go up with your field of view. You need to render more in front of you, so you will lose kind of some FPS. I did some tests, it's not that bad. I lost like 2 FPS when I play at 105, and normally I just play at 95 in the game. So, uh, you will not see a big impact over there, so d don't touch it. It's not like a, it's a, it's not a huge thing. The huge thing is shadow quality. Shadow quality, this one, make sure that you're running at lowest and also foliage detail, uh, sorry, foliage shadow distance, same thing, put medium, uh, it's kind of the minimum in the game. Uh, just this, you will gain 12 to 15 FPS. For each bracket here, I saw an Im improvement of 3, and four F 3 to 4 FPS depending on the bracket, so uh, that's pretty good. And for me, shadow is not something really important when I play a game. And you know, in PvP, when you play PvP, you don't care about shadow, honestly. So this one, really important, just lower it. Uh, for texture quality here, that's really cool. You have the VRAM usage. So if you come right, as you can see right now, I just used 2.5 on 8 gig. So uh, I can stay at IS, I don't have any problem. But if you're uh, missing VRAM on your video card, Make sure that you have like some range over there because uh, you can see drop frame when you render a lot of uh, texture, but not necessarily texture, but when you have to render more than your card can support. So yeah, texture and isotropy, 4x for me, you can go lower than that, 2 to 3 FPS, but if you go to I, 8 it's, or 16, I saw a, a big decrease for 16 on my AMD card. Uh, not on the NVIDIA one, but uh, they will probably release like driver to fix that because it's really weird I'm losing like 20 FPS uh, Very weird about it uh, NTL easing this one just use FX AA if you remove NTL easing uh, your image quality will t decrease too much but honestly if you have a low-end or mid-range computer it's not worth it to play with SMAA or MSAA just play with FX AA and you will have a nice uh, quality of pictures so after that, if you still don't have your 60 FPS, you will need for sure to re uh, lower all the distance thing over here. Character of environment, you, you can start with environment, just put it at low, just this, you will gain another 4 FPS. Look at it, if you still don't have your 60, you can go with detail distance, same thing. And at the end, you can change the character one. Character one, you don't gain a lot, it's 1 FPS. So make sure that you're touching the detail in the environment first and for sure shadows because I told you uh, when I started the video and uh, yeah, that's about it. One more thing, motion blur for me, remove it. I don't like the effect. If you like the effect, keep it. But I saw 2 FPS average on my AMD car of improvement. So this one can be kind of good because if you don't like the effect, you will gain some performance and you will remove it. So that's pretty much it. Finally. Render resolution, uh, this one, it's a uh, one-to-one -one for now. If you go lower than that, you will see a huge decrease in your image quality. So if, for example, if you're playing at 90%, you're downscaling your uh, game. 
uh, I really don't like it. I prefer just to change some parameter over there. But this is like the last resort if you have like a pretty low end computer and you 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 can manage to do even 50 FPS because you will see some pixel and stuff. It's not really nice to, to play with this. So that's about it, guys. If you have any question, just comment in the YouTube section. Post me your CPU, GPU and RAM. I will try to help you the best that I can. Don't forget to uh update your driver because probably nvidia and amd will release a couple of driver for the next week uh with some improvement in this game and uh, yeah that's about it thank you very much bye bye